guys, this is Sam, and I'm doing another review for you today as my roommate's dog chases her tail. Okay, she's done. <laughs> anyway, um, today I'm going to be doing another review for you today. Roman's Berry Breeze, and they are a, a shisha pipe tobacco, so they have a bit more stronger tobacco than normally used, like Starbuzz or Fumari. Um, and today, so I'm going to be doing that review for you today on the cut of the hookah, uh, cut of the sheesh. Um, it looks very minced. There's no long leaves. There's no anything like that. Um, and how I would describe what it looks like, when I put it in the bowl, it looked exactly like oatmeal. It was really quite humorous. Um, and so... That's what it's really minced. It's not like hookah hookah or hookah free cut where it's you can't even tell it's tobacco, but it's very minced, very finely cut. Um, on the smell, it smells almost exactly like a berry tie dye fruit roll up, so it smells rather delicious. But it has a back smell of the tobacco, which is normal, which means that Roman has a little bit stronger tobacco. Um, on my setup today. I have a Maya QT with a large funnel bowl on the top. Sorry about the shaking. And I'm using three coconaras on the bowl. As for how it's smoking, smoking very good. That's partially the coals and partially the tobacco, of course. It's smoking very well. Um, the taste I'm getting from it. It still has that taste of a very tie-dye fruit roll-up, though not as strong. It has more of a, like, not like a potpourri sense, but more of like a flowery undertone to it, like underlying the berry taste to it. So that's, it's very breezy, very light. It's a very good, um, like, not like a for a beginner hookah person, but it, and it's not for an, like, it can be for an expert, but an expert doesn't have to smoke this, you know. You don't have to have the experience behind you to smoke this. It's more like an intermediate, like, hey, let's try this tonight, you know. Um, as for trickability on the smoke, rather good, as you can see, since I'm a mediocre smoking person. Um, and so it has very good smoke, like I said, it has a very breezy undertone, it's very light, it's not as strong taste as the smell is, so that's very nice also, but we're getting nice big clouds off of this as you can see. As for my rating today, I'm going to give it a 7.5 between an 8, um, because um, I'm really not a person to give out tens very often. Um, hopefully I'll give out a few on a couple reviews, but this is one that it's good straight. I'm not usually a straight, uh, straight one flavor bowl person, but this was really, this is really good with one flavor, but it'd also be a very good mixer. It would add a lot to like a citrus or like a lemon if you wanted like to throw in some craziness there um anyway so i give it a 7.5 between an 8 yeah 7.5 so i would recommend you guys go out and get maybe a 50 of it um it's not something i'll have in my collection all the time um but it's definitely something that's good to have around as a good mixer all right guys we shall see you later and As always, keep your collections up and your drawers full and keep on smoking. Thanks.